hydrogen, or H for short, has some real superpowers that can be used to reduce CO2 emissions in industry. It carries a lot of energy and is by far the most abundant element in the universe. On Earth, however, hydrogen is mainly found in a bound state, for example in water. We can obtain it in its pure form through chemical processes. Depending on the type of process used to obtain it, we assign different colors to hydrogen. For example, we call it gray hydrogen when it is produced using fossil fuels such as natural gas. Green hydrogen means that it is produced using only renewable energy. Water is split into oxygen and hydrogen using electricity from the sun, wind, or water. This separation is done by electrolysis. Direct current is passed through two electrodes into the water. Oxygen accumulates at the positively charged anode, while hydrogen is produced at the negatively charged cathode. The process results in twice as much hydrogen as oxygen. Since water is not a good conductor, the current needs help to flow. With additives, you have to turn it into a lye, but it can also be done in a more environmentally friendly way, with pure water, thanks to PEM electrolysis. Here, a proton exchange membrane assists the movement of particles between the anode and cathode. This is how you get renewable green hydrogen. An electrolyzer can stabilize electricity grids and balance power peaks when consuming power. In refineries, it enables the production of sustainable fuels and chemicals. In this context, the valuable green hydrogen is not burned, but used to make more environmentally friendly products. Green hydrogen is an important contribution to meeting Europe's climate goals, strengthening our economy, and protecting the environment.